This is Brooklyn. Brooklyn is a black YouTuber who was known for doing commentary. Brooklyn created Pointless on Sunday, November 29th, 2020. His first video is called Jake Paul Defeats Nate Robinson Boxing Match. It was uploaded on the same day. Just welcome to the first video on the Pointless YouTube channel. All right, don't judge me if this video was terrible. Today we're going to be talking about the fight between Jake Paul and Nate Robinson, where Nate Robinson got hit with the TKO. Like, I kid you not, I thought it was an episode of WWE Monday. If you aren't familiar with these people, uh, the loser named Jake Paul, he's uh, a vlogger, walks around with his little camera, and his brother went in a forest. And Nate Robinson is a basketball player who's like 5'2". I, that, that, that's what they are, right? That's what they do. And long story short, boys and girls, this fight has been anticipated for a while, and yesterday it went down. Down, and let's just say Nate Robinson, he got set down like a baby, picked him up, set him down, boom, it's over. Because the first round, he was already downed by Jake Paul. And I kid you not, the second round, Jake Paul hit him with a punch so hard that I thought he was going to outer space. Now, I wasn't rooting for either one of them. I just wanted to see who would win because, yeah, everybody's been talking about it, hyping it up. And, uh, yeah, I was not disappointed because Jake Paul put on a show, knocked this man out, success at outer space. But, uh, yeah, that's really all that happened. He got knocked out completely. On Thursday, July 22nd, 2021, he did a face reveal. And here it is. All right, we're about to get into the long-awaited face reveal. You guys have waited a, a while for this, all right? So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. Oh, I forgot to mention that uh, there's a lot of bopping throughout this face cam little segment. So, uh, yeah, ignore it. All right, I was an idiot. I had my mic too close up to my face. Uh, yeah, let, let's... What is up, everyone? All right, welcome back to another video on the Pointless YouTube channel. Here it is, face reveal. Uh, it's it's long-awaited. You guys wanted it, so here it is. I'm recording this off of my phone since I didn't really have time to, you know, go ahead go out and buy my webcam so we gotta be makeshift here we gotta be homemade and get this video recorded on the phone here it is uh, i'm literally holding my mic i don't have a mic stand i, I don't have any of that right we're we're going crazy on the pointless youtube channel on a budget but uh yeah i just wanted to thank you guys quickly before we continue with this video for the support on the channel recently we just hit 60,000 subscribers today that's insane you guys have been like honestly blowing up the channel recently so thank you and uh yeah we're gonna have that youtube black suit and i'm gonna record it i guess and a video or something like that if you guys do want it but today i'm just going to be answering a lot of frequently asked questions about just me youtube and just a lot of stuff about me that you guys really don't know i want this to be more so of a personal video not too long but just you know a bit of my face and we may talk about something else in the video i'm not quite sure but one of the main questions i get asked a lot is how old am i all right and uh well i am 188 years old i don't know if you guys know uh yeah you can see i'm very old uh, I'm, I'm extremely just obese and old second question i get asked a lot is what i used to edit my videos and uh well i use the editing software called sony vegas 14 believe it or not uh i edit on here game plan here talk about vegan teacher for a while and you guys love it you guys enjoy it and yeah that's really what i use i've never really used anything different i had to edit on my tablet years ago uh on an old 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 channel but uh yeah i've always used this since i've been you know having a computer so it's really not hard to start youtube also and Brooklyn then explains that he did commentary on an old channel he had years ago, which is how I've known about him because I used to be one of his subscribers in the summer of 2020. Also, a lot of you guys do seem to wonder, like, when I started doing commentary, and, uh, well, I started doing commentary years ago. I mean, I had a super, super old channel, but as of now, I, Pointless is, like, the only channel I've actually taken serious, and when I took it serious, you guys seemed to actually super, like, extremely enjoy it. I, I don't know if that made any sense, but you guys have been enjoying it, so I'm gonna keep going with these videos, all right? I'm gonna keep putting them out. Then, 21 days later, on Friday, August 13th, 2021, Brooklyn reached 100k subscribers. Alright, what is up everyone? Alright, welcome back to another video on the Pointless You- What was that? What is up everyone? Alright, welcome back to another video on the Pointless YouTube channel. And listen, I just got home from school. Ignore the sock on the mic. I know what's the problem, alright? I, I actually need to spend money for once and buy a pop filter. But what is up everyone? I honestly just wanted to come to you guys with a quick video today. I'm not gonna make a super long video. I just wanna honestly thank you all so much. We hit 100,000 subscribers this morning. It is insane. I believe we're almost at 101k right now, which is wild. We've already gained a hundred thousand, uh, what? We've already gained, well, yeah, that too. I mean, we've already gained a hundred thousand subscribers in eight months, like... 
Yeah, I know. It's insane. Like, that that's the exact same face I was making, bro. I don't know where this is going, but long story short, just thank you guys, honestly, because I started this channel in November. Uh, I was in a call with one of my friends, and honestly, I did not know what to do. Uh, I was trying to talk to multiple people about making a new channel because uh, if you guys didn't know, I had an old channel a while ago, but uh, it, it honestly went nowhere. So I had to end up, you know, making a new channel to, you know, try to get a new audience. And well, uh, you know, it, it paid off. You guys have been honestly one of the best things that ever happened to me. So thank you all so, so much. Like, I did not exist this channel to, you know, get this big, like, actually go anywhere or get successful, you know? Having people, you know, come up to me and say that they, you know, watch my videos is crazy. It, it happens and it, it's crazy. Just honestly, thank you guys for the support. I never expected to hit this. Like, we're not stopping here. We're going 500k, a million, millions. I'm, I'm talking about we. This is just the start, all right? Trust. But, uh, yeah, to since then, when Brooklyn was pointless, he had a lot of controversies and criticisms coming his way. Many small and medium commentary YouTubers were calling him out for clickbaiting. And Brooklyn has done those videos of that vegan teacher, SS Sniperwolf, Nick Capcado Avocado, Miaba, EDP445, Deleting soon, Jelly Bean, and his own death. And despite all the controversies against him, he still grows his YouTube channel successfully in 2022. Brooklyn stopped uploading on Pointless nine months ago at the time of making this video. And at the time of recording, Pointless has 320k subscribers. Nine months ago, on Sunday, May 14, 2023, Brooklyn made his new channel called Slash. And his first video on Monday, May 15, 2023 is called Spice Kings Must Be Stopped. Yo, what is up, everyone? Welcome to my channel. Well, this is my first video. I am Slash, for those of you who obviously do not know me. And I'm going to be dropping absolute amazing content on this channel, so make sure to subscribe. But without further ado, we're going to be reacting to the worst Spice Kings, because these Spice Kings got to be stopped. But uh, yeah, let's get right into it. John Red Takis. Bro, if I hear one more Taki Crunch, I'm about to turn into King Von spinning on the op block. I swear to God, these Spice Kings have, like, the combined brain cells of a damn dog and a cat. Like, holy shit, bro, stop crunching in my ear. Habanero Gummy. Giant blue Taki. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this dude Spicy definitely begin his back blown out, bro. It's pretty apparent that he's uh, a rainbow warrior. If you get what I'm hinting at, you get what I'm hinting at, all right? But let's just say uh, this man is not straight. He's very crooked. And the sight of men gets him a little um, excited. Like, who the hell puts that in their video in front of millions of people, bro? What the fuck? Oh, no. <laughs> Spicy ramen. The next day, he uploaded a video called the worst roblox youtuber fast forward to six to four months ago brooklyn has made a lot of relatable commentary content such as when you don't peak in high school girls not having any ribs the laws of being black or how to survive in high school things we all did as kids the worst back to school outfits and many more just about nearly four weeks later, Brooklyn uploaded his last video on Slash. And no surprise there, it's another one of those annoying deleting soon videos with a clickbait title. What's up, quick announcement? I made a new channel, Go Sub, alright? Uh, if you want to watch my videos every day, go watch those. Uh, here on this channel, I'm just going to be chilling, doing whatever. Uh, I'm going to go and post on this channel super consistently, and you definitely going to want to see what I have on there, so go subscribe. It's going to be highlights from my stream, which I already post on this channel. You can catch all of my streams on this channel, so go subscribe, man. Just, just go subscribe, that's all I can really say. But the next, and hopefully final, YouTube channel Brooklyn Link to is very different on the topic commentary videos he's done.
Now slash 4L is one of the channels he created back on Saturday, December 9th, 2023. But Brooklyn's other channel, slash 4L, the one that's uploading semi daily, is a channel Brooklyn created back on Tuesday, September 19th, 2023, and and uploaded four months ago. And as of the making of this video, his previous video was over 17 hours ago. Now, Brooklyn is a very talented black creator, and he has a passion for YouTube. He's genuinely one of the coolest down-to-earth black YouTubers I've ever watched. But the question remains, will he stick with one channel forever and just upload until he reaches 1 million subscribers like he said he would? Or would he create another channel again for the sixth time? 